Hello and welcome to another FTL Let's Play. We're gonna go back and try hard again. So forget this normal stuff, didn't even succeed doing it. Let's do hard. Um, let's, uh, let's... What ship have we not done? That I want to do hard on. I'd love to go back to this one, but we'll wait a while to do that. Uh, what about something with teleportation? How about one of these guys? Oh, I like the, the big teleportation. But, oh, you'd have no weapons, though. What about uh, big teleportation? Lock the room. Stun the room. Don't need to heal. I like that. Um, oh, do you know what ship I really enjoyed playing? Let's go to the list. It was the one of these guys um, where you let all the oxygen out. I think it might have been... I thought I had teleportation. Yeah, okay, it's this one here. So let's try this one on hard. Um, let's get... <clears throat> now what we'll do at the start is we'll actually just put these guys in teleportation because we're going to teleport a lot. And then it might be a little bit of a cheat, but we're going to let all the oxygen out. So that way if we get boarded, it's a little bit more protected. We're going to have to put in a power into the doors though. Keep this guy... Keep this guy safe there in his little, uh, his little cockpit. <laughs> right, let's see how this works for us. Okay, NG crew. Yes, we will take blue options. Of course we will. Let's put some, uh, one of our power points into the weapons. Always useful to have weapons in, in games. Is there a game out there that's not useful to have a weapon? Maybe. I think I'd like to play it, actually. Okay, let's uh, let's let's get attacking. Um, let's go after the weapons. Mind control. All right. Now he's gonna get a shot in off on us. Hope this missile misses. It does indeed. Now let's continue the attack because we want to shoot his weapons. To be honest. We should have done that earlier. Okay, we let him get that hit on us. That was a little bit stupid. But hopefully it'll work out for us. We get this. We won't even have to get take the oxygen then. We can just destroy him. And now we could just wait. But let's not do that. <laughs> He's running away from us. Okay, excellent. And we get... We get uh, larger rewards for doing it like this might take a little bit longer but that's okay um we're trying to beat it on hard here we'll have to eke every little advantage we can out of this game i i think um it's per i'm perfectly justified doing that okay i want to hit up a few things before this store nothing and we will bear in mind the doors would be a great option to us. Um, okay, what is this one? Uh, another rebel checkpoint is monitoring this location. A number of civilian ships are awaiting inspection. Any of them could be Federation loyalists. The rebels haven't noticed you yet. Okay, last time we actually uh, we we helped the civilians, but ooh, this that doesn't seem to actually. I'm not going to bribe them. I'm not going to spend my money. Let's just fend for ourselves and tack our way out of this. Okay, we're going to teleport into, into oxygen this time. And we are going to shoot the weapons this time. Seems a bit more sensible of an option. Okay, got a hit on us, but his main weapons is down. Let's stay after the... The weapons, our guys will probably die, but that's not the end of the world. They will respawn. Let's get them out of the room before we shoot them, though. No point uh, giving up on them immediately. Oh, wow, they got those weapons back extremely quickly. I did not see that coming because I was not looking. Is the main problem there? Okay, we're gonna stick on the oxygen 
and we're going to shoot the weapons again. Right, will we accept? We will accept this offer. Our shields are down. We're look. Actually, you know what? We won't. Their weapons are down. Yeah, we'll 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 get such a higher reward by taking this ship over. We gotta take risks. This is hard, but risks have to be taken. We get this oxygen down. We are in a good position. Oh, shot my guy. Okay, well, whatever. We still got a better reward. It's not the end of the world. I'll get my guy back here. We'll heal up the ship while we're waiting. <laughs> Shooting your own crew members. Didn't I didn't notice how low the enemy ship had got. Okay, for this method, we're going to have to start thinking about having better shields. We're going to have to think about, well, lots of things, really. Drone, some sort of drone control to shoot down missiles would be very helpful. Now, there's not really much we can do in this shop, but we're committed to going now. Right, is there anything we're missing out on? No, not really. Anti-bio beam. Difficult to say, but a great weapon. Uh, I'd rather the flank cannon, though. It's just such a nice weapon for one power unit. You can take shields down late game, depending on how we're going to. Depending on how we're going to play this game, that could be so useful in so many ways. So no, I'm not going to sell this special weapon that only you can, you can only get from playing this ship, I believe. Okay, let's aid them. Go in. Oh, meant to go for oxygen. We keep running in against the uh, against ship with missiles. That is so dangerous to us. But that should be um, that should be it for us. I don't think we're even going to lose this crew member. Actually, I should have shot the weapons. He's probably in there repairing. He is indeed. Okay, excellent. Lots of rewards. And let's heal our ship up. We're also... It would be convenient for us to level up the cloning bay. Very convenient. If we got if we got more crew members, we would let the oxygen back in and have them man these spaces. Okay, what do we do? We anything we feel really desperate that we need? Um, no, not. I'd rather keep my money for a few more turns. I think that might be the biggest mistake I'm making this game, but I think you have to take risks early on. Okay, automated ship when we're teleporters is usually really bad news, but our teleportators, if that's a word, do not require oxygen. So this should not be as bad as the same. We are going to have to destroy this ship though. Uh, no, let's send them over here. Well, he's used hacking on the one system we can't even use. Okay, if he times his shots well, he can do damage against us, but the computer doesn't usually do that. No, he can't. He can't do any damage against us. We're just going to use a flat cannon to take him down. Once these guys take down the shields, you can use your guys, to, your um, what do we call them, crew members. You can use your crew members to farm experience. When they take down a room here, they're going to increase their fighting experience. So in a situation like this, you can just farm it. I don't know why I need to pause it there. Okay, we'll take him down. Next go. No, we won't. That looked like a hit to me. Okay, what have we got? Only one useful thing out of it, but that's 
not the end of the world. Uh, convince him to make a better deal. Yeah, I'm all for that. States that the offer was actually a lie and they plan to attack your ship. By the time he returns to the senses, you've already prepared your ship to fight. Alright, that's, uh, I guess, good. Is this two laser beams he has against us? It is indeed. So this should be absolutely no trouble to us. Uh, we will go into... Let's we we'll go after oxygen and we'll use the you know what, we'll fight in here and use mind control. Have three of them in a room at the same time. And we'll go after the med bay. Which is the most important thing really to take down here. If we fight them while the med bay is up, they'll just continuously take it down. We went for oxygen, we actually hit our own crew members. These guys, these guys, oh crap. These guys are fairly expendable though. In the sense that we can just recharge them. I did it again. Didn't notice I was killing the ship. That is wasteful because we would we would have got scrapped more of the order of about 25, just as a guesstimate, if we hadn't have done that. But that's fine. Um, okay, I think we'll just go ahead and upgrade the shields, get us through a fight or two. We'll leave it down at two for the moment, but we will we'll change that as situations arise. I'm not sure why two of these doors are... Oh yeah, of course, the hacking. One strange thing the hacking uh, weapon does, once it takes over a room, it, it closes the doors when it leaves. Oh, it closes the doors and they stay closed for the rest of that. Uh, for the rest of the game, I guess, until you choose to change it. Now, what has he got? He's got only laser beams. Good thing about that is the fact that we've got double shields. So I believe we can survive that. Um, what are we going to do without though? I will do without the cloning bay until I start getting those alarms to tell me I have no cloning bay, your guys are dead. Which we will keep an ear out for. Uh, no, we don't need to take his shields down. Alright, this time we are going to pay a bit more attention to the fact that how, how damaged the ship is and so forth. Okay, we didn't get the extra rewards that you get from the, the victim. Right. We we get the HP though. We have returned from this. Okay, so we're going to probably update, update that clone very soon. Not quite yet. Let's see what we can do with some of this money. Okay, with two shields, again, this ship cannot, cannot damage us. So we're just going to kill the ship as quickly and as efficiently as we can. Again, if we had a little more time, if I wasn't making a video here, if, if there wasn't the slightest pretense of entertainment in this video, I would probably just let these guys farm out attacks, increase their... Why am I pausing it? I don't know. Increase their damage and so on. Okay, I actually cannot use another advanced flak. It could take the ship down. We'll just we'll get one more um, a level up from our. Actually, I couldn't have destroyed the ship, but either way, I can now. Uh, one more level up from their attack. For their attacking ability. Okay, pretty good. All this capturing of ships is really helping our, our money situation, our scrap situation, or bottle caps, whatever you, unit of currency you want to think in. Okay, nebulas, nebulas. I've I've come to this. Wow, a lot of nebulas. I've started to reconsider the fact maybe nebulas are more useful to go through. I think it might slow down the advancing ships a bit. 
But to be honest, they're just so annoying. I hate them. I'm avoiding them. Please let me know in comments. Is that a mistake? Is it uh, EV? Is it plus EV? Is it is your expected value of, of getting scrap higher in nebulas or getting rewards? Please let me know. We'll certainly hit up these nebulas because they're such a big reward for the ship being slowed. The your the people of whoever is attacking us in this game catching up. I will learn who's attacking me someday. I will learn the storyline of this game soon. I've only played it two years, so give me a few moments. Okay, attack this ship. Uh, we will take... No, we're invulnerable once those shields are up, so let's just leave them the way they are. Identical layout as before. Okay, we take the shields down in case we lose a crew member without me noticing. Of course, with the, the clone bay off, I've not been healing my crew members either, which is a problem. There's no real reason to attack there. I'm keeping an eye on the health of the other ship, so I don't die stupidly, but... Other than that, where is this guy? Of course, he's going after a weak crew member all the time. Okay, excellent reward. We're not... I'm not too sure I'm going to be using this weapon. Uh, well done, game. I, oh, wow. All right, this is going to take a few moments. We're going to have to... <laughs> just released all the oxygen I did. Uh, we're going to have to get oxygen back to the ship. Let this guy repair it before we can get back. I didn't see how they damaged that. I did not see how they even got a weapon through. I thought we were immune to being attacked. Okay, let's just see what's in the vicinity. Right, we're going to upgrade one or two things. We'll get a power reactor and... No, just, uh, just um, upgrade our reactor. That, that's going to be enough for us for the moment. Okay, let's clear out the rest of these nebula. Of course, always... A I don't think he can get through our shields either. Uh, always attack these ships. Let's help them along the way though. Do a bit of damage. One more attack. Yeah, I don't think I can kill my crew members this way. Uh, we'll let them take down one more group before finishing the ship off. Alright, we've we've been lucky. We've have we've had a, quite a few easy easy rooms to deal with so far. Okay, wow, nice. We're picking up some good weapons. Whether we use these weapons or not isn't actually that important. We can sell them. Okay, charge. Let's let's think a bit about this. The charge uh, laser. That's a pretty good weapon for late game. Can take down lots of shields. Want to get to this store? I think we can hit up. Okay, we can't get the store and all all of down here. What about? Ooh, that'll be difficult to get to. Let's plan our map here. I feel, I partially feel that we've um, outstayed our welcome in this nebula as well. We're riding our luck. We're bound to run into a storm soon. Do you know what? I'm just going to go to stress up here, shop, back out towards the exit. That is my current plan. And we'll we'll assess which of these weapons and, and systems we're going to build towards once we get to that shop. It's going to be able to tell us quite a bit about our ongoing strategy. Or strategy going forward, maybe I should say. Okay, they're preparing to power up. That is quite dangerous to us. Because, quite dangerous to us. Because they could just jump away with our crew members. I'm not sure if the cloning bay recharges them in that case. Surely. 
surely it does. Okay, engines taken out, that's very important. Let's leave them in this room so they're unlikely to come in and attack because of the lack of oxygen. Let's go after. Let's suck all the oxygen out of all the rooms. Oh, there they are. Fixing the oxygen. Sneaky. Excellent. Nice enough rewards again. Now, I would be tempted to repair uh, or upgrade my cloning bay just to heal these guys a little bit extra this turn. But because we're going to the shop, oh, two shops. So if we don't like anything here, we're not going to buy. We're not going to buy half measures. Something we really like, we'll buy. Not, we'll wait. Okay, we're not going to change the med base, the system we have. Upgrading to sensors, that could be interesting. Drone control, that could be very interesting. Ooh. You know what? Let's pause the video here and I'll let you guys think about it. Tune in next video, see what I decide. Will I go clone drone control? Will I move on to the next um, to the next shop, see what's there? Obviously, I'm really just doing this so I can spend an extra few minutes thinking it through. But thanks for watching the video. There will be a link below to the next video if that's out already. And uh, another link to all my FDL uh, videos, uh, the playlist of all of them. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed them. And goodbye.